What's up, good people and Eagle fans? Mark Holmes here, of course, with Reaction. Uh, Michael was pointing out that this shirt, this is actually one of the men tees that are, you know, uh, fresh fresh tees or whatever it is that are made for us old men with men bods and stuff. And he said, well, it actually matches the hat. But it's not Eagle's colors. It's not Eagle's colors. It's not Eagle's colors. And in fact, boring. actually, you know what? Let, let me say, Lord Brunson... Okay, I hate your team. Okay, I hate your team. But I tell you what, I actually love the hat. Now, this this is a perfect hat, except for the hurt season. Sorry, you know, I, I, is that saying something bad? I I just don't. I'm, that's it's just not me. It's just not. Well, that's me. saying something nice but, about. But the hat Lord itself. The hat itself. I, I I like the way it fits on my head. I just I'm not crazy about the look of it. So this is, this is Hump Day. I'm getting over the hump. Oh, what? Yeah. Um, we, we, we could discuss after the video. Okay, so. About how to end the, end the, the thing. Well, I'm still. People keep saying that they want me to auction the hat off, okay? Um, I guess I guess we could do that. You know, I don't. How, how would we do that? I mean, how do you auction something? Do they have an app or something for doing that? I don't know. Do, you, do we put it like on eBay or something that like that? The only way you can you can do auction on eBay. I, I guess yeah. Let me see about that because do I have an eBay? Maybe we put it on eBay. And then you let it's it, it's worn. I mean, it's a used hat. Okay. Now I thought about here's what I thought about doing was using it today working on the red brick house, but then it would have gotten really dirty and nasty. And I see. I just washed my hair, you know, and so it, yeah, I'm, you're my hair's clean. Off, you don't want it. You don't want yeah, it dirty. Yeah, but you know. Uh, uh, here's here's going to be the problem. See, you know, again, I like the hat, uh, with the exception of it being, you know, eagle stuff. If it didn't have that on there, I'd say great. I love the camouflage color because I've got, you know, this. See, if, if you could put this logo on, I'd be happy. See, this is from my friend Daniel. Daniel gave me the Cowboys camouflage, so I I, I do like that. Salute the service NFL. Um. So maybe we will do that for, you know, raise some money or something or other uh, for it and see, I, I guess. I guess I could put the hat on eBay. I, I, I mean, what do I do? Uh, Mark Holmes wore hat. Okay. Uh, Mark Holmes, Lord Brunson wore a hat. Sign. Uh, the sign. Doing his walk of shame <laughs> with autograph. Okay. <laughs> but I, I, I'm... Just trying to understand. So actually, I'm actually going to talk on this one since this is the last one. I want to give you guys. And oh, I know uh, what I was going to say is here's the problem. The hat is it, it's made. It sits up on your head. Okay. And I I, I can't drive. I'm sorry. I, I can't drive like I, it does. That doesn't work. Okay. Because literally, I, I can't see. Okay. I guess I. Oh, wait a minute. Let me let me try and get as much. Okay. There we go. All right. That just looks, looks stupid. Yeah, I know. I, I feel like Gomer Pyle. Okay, but I, I'm trying to give the the because because we know there will be people out there saying he didn't honor the vet. He's a Welch. Man, get out of here with the crap. I have done seven videos plus a live stream during the game. Oh, oh, wait, 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 no, no. What? But you were wearing it incorrectly. Oh. Okay. That's what I was still wearing it, okay? <laughs> That's what Eagles fans would say. Oh, you wore it incorrectly. You know, I, I hate to say it, but, you know, Eagles fans are kind of like that beautiful woman that no matter what, they're never satisfied. I'm beautiful, so you've got to go above and beyond everything for me. And it's just like, okay, you know what? You're just crazy. But Robert Quinn, you know, here's the thing. Okay. That light. See, look, I just went through a red light because I'm doing this hat, okay? Well, then wear, Thank it, you. Then wear it correctly so you don't have to. You don't Because I couldn't see the damn light, okay? <laughs> they, 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 uh, they, I guess I can lean like this, okay? They got, they got their few minutes of you wearing it correctly. All right. Robert Quinn, okay? I'm, 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 not, I'm not saying anything negative about the Eagles. I have to say that the Eagles, they don't, they don't, they, they, they don't, they're not scared. They're not scared to make a move, okay? They will bring people in. They get beat up on it and, and stuff. They just move right on, and they keep trying. You know, nothing beats, uh, you know, uh, I can't remember how the saying goes. But listen, you try, and you do good with it. In fact, I, you know, I wish my Cowboys had a little bit more of that bringing in guys. You know, we, we ended up bringing in um, 
uh, Hankins yesterday, you know, defensive tackle to help us with our run game and stuff. But I'm trying to understand because I thought that the Eagles defense, thought that the Eagles defense would – Jordan Davis and that the Jordan Davis. He only had a uh, what what, you know Jordan Davis and uh, what what's the linebacker? Um, Cox. No 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 that's Jabril Cox is us. But uh, the, they, the, no they the, had the, one guy named Cox that was on their team. Pause. No I mean there is a guy that plays one that's named Cox I forget. Pause. But he but he's, I think he's injured though. Okay. Um, <laughs> but I thought that um, everything was great with that defense. And that Jordan Davis, the next Reggie White, was going to be revolutionizing the defense, along with the the line that that weak side linebacker that you guys had. That everything was good. They only had twelve tackles, but from a defensive tackle position, that, you and know, seven of them were sold. Well, quite frankly, when, when you think that he's oh. only good for two plays and he's only played six games, that that's about right. That's yeah. that's good. Well, it, it is good for for our number one pick. Right for right number one pick that you gave him extra draft guy. Yeah, he's he's okay. He's big. He's, okay. he's big. But he'll be scary down the road once he starts getting physically into the NFL shape. But I'll Robert Quinn, I was looking at the numbers. Now, now again, I'm not mad at you for going to get Robert Quinn, but I'm not sure what Robert Quinn that you're going to get because and this is not trying to be hateful or anything like that. There's perception and then there's reality. Because now last year, 18 and a half sacks. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. But the year before, two. The year before that, with us, the Cowboys, 11 and a half. The year before that, he had five. And it looks like when you go through the totality of his career, it's like he has one great year, and then he has a bad year. He has a great year, and then a bad year. Although he did have two bad years there together. So I'm not sure what you are getting with him because this year he's got eight tackles, two assists, and one sack. And what that may end up being is that he's taking playing time away from somebody else. Now, again, you know, we got players that we're not playing on the defensive line. You know, Terrell Basham can't get in there. I don't know what's going on with Nabell Gallimore for us and things. You know, um, but having more players, like Mike McCarthy said, you know, when we brought in Hankins, um, you can never have enough of those guys. So, shout out to the Eagles for continually trying to turn over the roster and get the best personnel possible. I, I can't dispute that. So, was that good enough for them? That now I can finally say, the hell with this hat. Time to auction it. Time to auction it. I wish you got the live auction. I don't know how you. How we? How can we do a live auction? Know. I don't know. We'll, we'll look and see if there's an app for that. Or there, something. Is, there is actually an app for that. I forget the name of it, but there is. I know app. one thing. My hands are. I've been doing brick work, guys. Um, oh, yeah, in that mud. I've too. been pounding brick, and, and I've been slinging a pick and an axe. You know, dig, digging holes, digging holes. And my hands are dry. Look at, look at how. Can you see it? Can you see how dry they are? They're like how dry I am. How dry I am. Nobody knows how dry I am. All right. I, I'm going to do something, Mike. I'm going to do a little bonus piece for you guys. You know, because I've been told that I'm not a good sport and things like that. You wore the hat for seven days. I, I wore the hat for seven days. I, I did. And see, this is where... Philly 500 is a dingbat, and I'm not saying that, you know, to be negative, but he calls himself a dingbat, okay? He, he, he knows he's a dingbat, okay? But I'm going to give you eagles what you guys really want. Now, I just spent the money for the hat. I'm trying to put money in the pocket of Lord Brunson. I've done the walk of shame seven times, okay, seven times times right but see here at Joe Boo Sports Report we're a good sport and we give the people what they want you know what they want what? you know what they want I, I gotta put the, the window down to do this because it'll probably stink
fly, eagles fly. I don't know the rest of the words. Fly, eagles fly. Okay. My son literally put his head down. All right. There you go. Philly, it's done.